Hello everyone, we are gonna take a look at this 3791 RD Montana. This really awesome camper comes in weighing 14,100 pounds for everything. So let's go ahead and show you some features on the outside first. The one thing that this camper is amazing about is the storage. So all the way at the back, you have this huge utility drawer. So if you have heavier items, you are able to pull it out pretty easily without having to crawl in there. And you have access uh, here on the sides of your camper to be able to get anything you want, but just really massive amounts of basement storage. And then all the way at the back, since you have your ladder, that means you have a fully walkable roof. You're even prepped for a rear view camera, so all you have to do is just purchase the actual camera part, pop it in there, and you're able to view the back of your camper while you're hauling it down the road. And then here is the other side of your basement storage. This also has frameless windows all across, which look really nice and sharp. And before I forget, the weight for this unit actually comes out to be 14,100 pounds for everything. At your entrance is those solid steps that everybody loves so much. So these will just swing in your camper very easily. You can do it with one hand, honestly. Um, great for little pets too, uh, very sturdy. Plus you have your big helper handle and you have this screen defender door. So you can kind of close this off and your dog can still be able to get that nice breeze without having to worry about them darting off. And you also have a power awning, so you have that extra shade if you need it. Outside speakers as well. And then at the front, you have even more storage. So big pass-through storage. Plus, you have your key TV satellite and cable hookup. And then this also has a road vac system built into it. So it comes with a 30-foot nozzle, and you can just plug that in there. And if something spills in your pass-through storage, um, you can just sweep that right up. Or I've seen people pull their cars up and just vacuum the insides of their cars as well if it happens to get dirty. Two propane tanks as well, one on this side, one on the other. And just like the rear view camera, you are also prepped for side marker cameras. So same thing, purchase the actual camera part, pop it in there and you're able to view the sides of your camper down the road. And that can be really nice for safety as well. Be able to see who's just, you know, right up against your camper, make sure things are all going good. At the very front is your um, battery box plus some additional storage. This also has six point auto leveling system or six point hydraulic levels. And then starting at the very front on the inside, you have your king size bed. This does have storage underneath so you are able to lift up the mattress. There is shelving and tables on both sides. Each side also has an outlet plus a USB port so you can plug your electronics in or sleep at machine while you're sleeping. And then before I forget, I wanna talk about the shades. So you have the nice pull down shades. Um, this bottom one allows for sunlight to come in, but just not so much. And then the top one is completely black out shades. So really, really nice. Behind me, is your closet wardrobe space. So a lot of extra room for all of your clothes that you're bringing, clothes rack up above. Outlet two, I'm not quite sure what you would plug in there, but at least you have one. Built-in shelving unit. And then this to my right is a laundry hamper. So you don't have to leave your dirty clothes everywhere. You can just have it nice and tucked away in there. Also gorgeous sliding mirror panel doors. To the right is actually a spot for your wash and dryer. So it is prepped for that. And this is also where they have the extra dining room chairs. Shelf, extra shelf, and clothes rack too. Across from your bed is your dresser. So even more storage. Six sets of drawers. And then you can use this for decorations too like we did. Plus you got your TV. And then I also want to point out this... Uh, Camper actually has the quiet cool system for the AC. So while you're running it, you don't have to hear all of the loud noises from the AC. It's very quiet and it's all throughout your camper. Barn style sliding door for some extra privacy. And same thing for your bathroom, another barn style sliding door. This also has the magnetic uh, latch to it. A lot of people like that. To my left is your porcelain foot flush toilet, nice and sturdy. 
And then you have this motion sensor, um, just extra closet space, and it kind of wraps around to the left. Um, there is just a lot of extra space in there, and it goes back really far. Plus, each cabinet has these soft clothes. Very fancy. Across from your entrance is your sit-down shower. Great for relaxing. Plus, you got your skylight up above there. And then across from your toilet is your sink. So, it is stainless steel, and it kind of swoops down a little bit. Storage all down below there. And then you have some extra cabinet space um, right next to your mirror. Again, with the soft clothes. Really cool. And I also want to point out there is just accent lights all across this camper that you'll see that are just really cool looking even on the um, island and countertops and stuff. Coming down on our steps, you have kind of a built-in hooks. Um, so you can put your keys here, your leashes, anything you want. And there's a cork board for like to-do lists or family photos, you know, little knickknacks and stuff that you find. Right next to your steps is your coffee bar. So this is just extra countertop space for food prep or, you know, you can call this a breakfast bar, coffee bar, because you do have a outlet out here. Um, so you can plug in your coffee maker, your air fryer, your blender, your margarita machine, have it all nice and ready right there and tucked away. Storage all down below. And again, with the accent lights look really cool. Just up above is just more cabinet space. Again, with the soft clothes, really awesome texture too for the glass doors. I love the diamonds, really nice. To the left is your pantry space and motion sensor again. So a lot of extra room for anything. This camper is all about your storage. And then kind of diagonal is your uh, residential size stainless steel refrigerator. And this one honestly is bigger than the one in my house. It's huge which means less trips for the grocery store. To the left is your stove area. So you have extra countertop space on either side that does have storage underneath. Um, plus, before we get into the stove, each one has its own pop-up outlet. So you can kind of hide that and tug it away when you aren't wanting to use it. But if you need to plug anything in, you have two outlets plus two USB ports. So now to our stove, you have your three burner stove top with a glass range cover and then a humongous uh, oven that is also stainless steel, kind of goes with everything. Residential size microwave, cabinets on either side, and you also have a built-in wine rack. Across from all of that is your island. So you have your 70-30 split stainless steel sink, pull spray nozzle. Um, and I love that the covers match the countertop. So again, if you need the extra countertop space, you can kind of cover up your sink and use all of this. Storage down below, but this to my left is hidden trash can storage. So you don't have to smell your dirty trash while you're trying to relax on vacation. Kind of extra random spots to put things. Show you what that looks like. And then across is your freestanding dinette. So this table is actually connected, but I still consider it freestanding. Um, the table does extend out as well. So with those extra chairs that are in your uh, washer dryer area, you can pull those out and have room for a family of four. Really comfortable, uh, soft material too. And then this down below isn't carpet. It is kind of like a vinyl material. So if you have pets with you or if someone spills something, you can easily wipe it up or vacuum it nicely. Another one of those pop-up outlets is right here too. Plus you have all of these windows so you can have a gorgeous view, trying to relax and eat dinner and stuff while still being a part of all the entertaining um, outside in your campsite. And then last but not least, this amazing living room space. So. This kind of is like an actual movie theater. Not only do you have those theater reclining seats that have built-in cup holders, remote control storage, plus they have accent lights, massage elements, and heating elements. But you can close this curtain off so whoever is staying here can have that extra privacy. Or if you're wanting to have a really fun family movie night, make it feel like an actual movie theater, you can kind of close that off. Each sofa does fold out into a sleeping spot, so... Again, guests, kids, uh, friends that are staying with you, they have a nice place to sleep. And then right across is your 
entertainment center. So big electric fireplace down below. This will actually take the chill out of the air. So if it's a really chilly morning or a really chilly evening, you can pop that sucker on and it's really, really nice and warm. Storage on either side. And then just above is your tinted glass. So that's where you can access um, all of the control panels for your TV and your outside speakers. And then your TV actually rolls down um, with the control. So you can really take advantage of that big window at the back of your camper. Um, but when you're ready to watch TV, you can just roll that sucker up. Pretty awesome. And you have storage on either side with the same detailing that is in the uh, kitchen cabinets. So that is it for this Montana, you guys. If you have questions or concerns about it, please let us know and we are happy to help.